Hey friends, welcome back to another video. Is there someone trying to manipulate you every time you talk? They just gotta have it their way no matter what it takes. And maybe you're aware it's all manipulation, but you still can't help but get angry and you wish you had a comeback for their manipulative tactics. Well, if you wanna stop that master manipulator once and for all, keep watching for some powerful comebacks. Number one, no. You probably already heard the expression, no is a full sentence. Even though sometimes you want to explain the reasons for rejecting someone like when talking to a friend or a family member, you don't need to justify yourself to anyone. No matter how hard a manipulator tries to make you do things their way, you have the right to refuse to do anything you're not comfortable with. Don't be afraid to say no and turn away. They really aren't worthy of an explanation. Number two. I don't care about your opinion. Manipulators usually take great pride in themselves and believe their opinions are the only right opinions and they try to make you believe the same. And since they're the masters of manipulation, most of the time they manage to push those opinions on others. But when you tell them you don't care about their opinion, suddenly their tactics fail. They can't believe someone doesn't care about their cherished opinion. If you use this comeback, you might get a confused expression and a minute of silence. Number three, I feel sorry for you. It's not uncommon for a manipulator to think they are superior and they believe that everyone else thinks the same. They think you'll believe anything they say simply because they're so great and important and they expect admiration. So telling them you feel sorry for them could be quite shocking to them. Bonus points if you explain why you feel sorry for them. They're just a sad, lonely person trying desperately to convince themselves that others like them. Number four, I don't have time for this. Because who does have time for being manipulated? Master manipulators feel the need to control and dominate everyone and everything, which also includes your time. They think they have the right to always be in your face with their tactics and demands. So tell them straightforwardly that there are so many things that are more important for you than they are. Let them know you're not available and that you refuse to spend even one minute listening to what they have to say. And number five, don't talk to me. What better way to stop a manipulator than to not even engage in a conversation? Sometimes that can even be the only choice you're left with. Of course, this comeback may not work instantly. Even if you try to shut them down, they will probably continue their mind games. So that's where you need to show them that you really mean it by walking away from them or simply ignoring them as if they're not there. This may seem petty at first, but your mental health and dignity is more important than their ego. Tell them you don't want them to talk to you and after that, make your actions speak even louder. Saying those things to such a dominating personality can feel scary and you might be afraid of their reaction and anger, but refusing to let them hold any power over you is the most important step to free yourself from their manipulative grasp. When you show them that you're not as weak as they think you are, they can't see you as their prey. So take a stand for yourself and don't be afraid of anyone. Have you had experiences with a manipulator? Let us know in the comments and share this video with anyone who may benefit. As always, the references and studies used are listed in the description. Until next time, and thanks for watching. Take care.